Two million. He's gonna make it two million straight. Oh, this could get ugly very fast. Please, all in. Yep. Well, he's going all in here. Yeah, he's saying, you got me beat, you got me beat. I'm pushing it. How much more? Yeah, it's about 1.7 million more, which is a lot right now at this stage of the game. Recognize how much money jumps from one place to the next from here out. Going from third to second is well over 300,000. And going from third to first is 1.1 million. But you've already put in close to 2.8 million. Well, that's virtually all you can beat here is a flush draw or a bluff. No doubt yes. about that. And the problem is, even if he's got a flush draw, you're not that big a favorite. So Raymond is feeling the pressure right now as to what to do. He does know this guy's capable of anything, but he's got to be saying to himself, you know, would this guy commit all his chips with a third raise with absolutely nothing into the chip leader? I wouldn't think so. But then again, we've seen how aggressive he plays. And I call. Raymond's going to make the call with the two aces. He's not going to like it. When Andres turns up his hand, well, there you see the grimace look on Raymond's face. A massive pot of over nine million here. And Raymond's going to have to get very lucky to win it. Going to have to catch a six to win it. A deuce would give him a split pot right now. But he is up against it. Well, the ace comes on the turn. So both players have three aces. It's a pretty good card for Raymond in that he can tie the hand with a king, queen, or a deuce. He can win the hand with a six. He'd love a tie right now. Everybody holding their breath. It's all coming down to this card right now. A ten comes off. So Andres has won the biggest pot of the night so far. A monster pot of over nine million. One step closer to that 1.8 million. Stay with us. We're coming back with more action here on the World Poker Tour. Welcome back to the World Poker Tour. Three players remain at the Commerce Casino. And right now we have a Hungarian, we have a Canadian, and we have an American. And they all walk into a bar. No, no, they all are playing here at the final table. Mike, and what a contest this is. You know, the American Raymond Dolan a minute ago had a big chip lead here. Now he just doubled up the Hungarian. He is now in a distant third place. Let's see if he can fight back to get back in this thing. Down to the table we go. Action on tree wing. Tree with the button has an ace deuce. 250. And he's going to make it 250,000 to go. Tree, a 32-year-old venture capitalist out of Vancouver, Canada. Raymond folds his jack eight, but look at Andres. Picks up a pair of ladies just like that. Andres, the poker pro out of Hungary. Says he likes to play aggressive like all the great Europeans do. Raise. He says raise. Mm, how much can you milk from the tree? He's going to make it 700,000 to go. Well, action's on tree here. He's going to lay his hand down. He shows him an ace. Sure. So Andres takes down yet another pot. The guy that came out here to rent a beach house in L.A. Yeah, the funny thing is, when I rent a beach house, I get my wallet stolen. <laughs> These guys win tournaments. The whole uh, Hungarian poker community is rooting for him. Uh, he would be really quite famous there, so yeah, it's a big deal. <laughs> He's loose aggressive. He likes to put the pressure on the opponent and... Uh, yeah, he isn't waiting for premium hands all the time or stuff like that. So I guess he has a good shot to win. And Vince, the guy we just saw in that interview, Anders' buddy Peter, he came in 46th place in this tournament himself. He cashed out 28,000. Seems like a mere pittance compared to what Andras is going to cash out there. Well, this time Andras picking a queen 10. He's first to act. He has the button, and he says, all in. I'm going to power through this. Oh, wow. Tree with an ace three. 
Well, he's got the best hand, but he's not going to gamble here with it. Will Raymond Dolan with a queen eight? Nope. So power poker there by the Hungarian taking down another pot. Well, it's Tree and Raymond up against the Hungarian. Can they slow him down? We will find out when we return on the World Poker Tour. Tonight's World Poker Tour brought to you by FullTiltPoker.net. Welcome back to the WPT. We're at the Commerce Casino. Three-handed poker. You can see the chip counts there. Andres Karopnai from Hungary, well out in front with over 10 million in chips. In second place, Tree Wing from Canada. He's got 3 million in chips. And in third place, the lone American, Raymond Dolan, with 1.7 million in chips. That's right. The restaurant manager of the restaurant. Come, Tom Fong Cow fold, folds this hand. Hold it. And now the Hungarian going to go all in with Jack-10. Now he's just putting pressure on the guy right now. And Wing cannot compete with his nine deuce. So the chip leader applying a lot of pressure, and it's going to work. Uh, power poker at its finest by the Hungarian now. He's got the chips, and he is going to step on these guys. Yeah, knows how to play good shorthanded poker. Action going right back at him. He's got a queen three, but this time, going to take a breather. Give the other guys a chance for a second. <laughs> all in. Tree wing with a queen nine says all in. He's going to try the all in play. Magic words. It's going to work. Raymond goes away. So Tree learning from Andres there. <laughs> he yeah. said, look, he went all in on me and won the pot. I'm going to try it here on my guy that's in the big blind. Tree wing, 32 years old. Born in Vietnam, moved to Canada when he was five. Very successful businessman and an incredible poker player. Takes a look at his hand. A pair of jacks, just like that. Nice hand. Gonna cap his card. Let's see what he's gonna bet. He's taking his time here. Trying to figure out how much to bet. He's got twice as many chips as the third place guy right now. Huge difference in prize money. 1.1 million between third place and first. 400. He's come in for 400,000. Okay. Raymond from Fountain Valley, California. No, he'll fold an A7. Oh, and look at this. Andres has picked up Ace King. He's got big slick. We could see big fireworks here between the two chip leaders. 2.5 million. Andres, I'll be shocked if he didn't move all in here. Hold in. Well, that's what he's going to do. He says all in. And this is almost auto call, I think. And yes, he eventually has to do it. Well, he calls, but does it with a little concern, Vince. He understands if he loses his pot, he's out of here in third place. Big difference between second place prize money and third, as well as first and third, obviously. But right now, we've got a classic coin flip, a race situation. Folks, how would you like to flip a coin for $1.1 million? That's essentially what these guys could be doing right now. All right, it's a big opportunity for Raymond. If Tree should happen to get eliminated, Raymond would slip into second place. Who is Lady Luck going to shine on this time? Will it be the businessman or the Hungarian? There it is! Wow! A king right on the flop! And right now, the tree must catch a jack or he's going to be eliminated in third place. The chainsaw is out. It is halfway down. Yes. They're cutting the tree. Fourth Street coming up. Let's take a look. A nine comes off, so we are down to the river. If the tree doesn't catch a jack on the river, his tree is going to be chopped down, and he'll be out of here in third place. Oh, boy. The tree stands for one last try. He needs to get lucky. Here comes the river. It's a 10. Wow. Timber. The Hungarian guy is giving their man a hug. But notice that Raymond Dolan's fans are hugging him as well. He's become a millionaire too. Tough luck for Tree. The tree has finally fallen. 665,000 richer. But that's going to do it for him. Two players remain going after a title. Stay tuned. We'll come back with the action in just a moment here on the World Poker Tour. Welcome back to the World Poker Tour. Here we go. The heads up action about to begin. 
Well, during the break, we had a chance to speak with Raymond and Andras. Here's what they had to say. Nagyon jó. Nem magam előtt látni ekkor a kupát zsetón, és látom az ellenfélnek semmilyen nincs szinte. Zseniális. I'm feeling all right. I mean, no short, so, you know, I just got to pray. I mean, it's, it's going to be tough. I just got to pick a hand and hope my hand stands up over his. Well, when we get down to heads up play on the World Poker Tour, you know what that means. Show us the money! See the custom trophy. Both of these guys are going to become poker made millionaires tonight. Whatever happens. About to get started. Our chip leader, Andres Korokni, out in full of 13.5 million. He has 90% of the chips. Yeah, the Hungarian well out front. Raymond Dolan of the U.S. with 1.4 million in chips. They both got game. A few double ups. Who knows what's going to happen? Let's go down to the felt. Vince, we know how quickly things can turn around playing heads up, no limit hold him. If, for example, Raymond won three pots in a row, he'd be the big chip leader. Action going to Andres. He's got a queen, eight of hearts. All in. And he's got a power punch, he says, all in. And he just has a queen four offsuit. All right, call. Whoa, he's made the call. I'm shocked by this. Let me know you. I mean, he's got 1.4 million in chips. I don't think it's necessary to move all in or make a call with that end, Vince. It's one thing to move in with it. It's another to call with it. Well, the blinds are only 75-150, so possibly a mistake. Who knows? Maybe he'll get lucky. And he's going to have to get lucky to stay alive, no doubt about that. Oh. Now the Hungarian, all excited. He knows this could do it right here if his hand holds up. Yep, he has his queen eight up against queen four for Raymond. Everybody on their feet here at the Commerce Casino. This tournament could be over in one hand. A four right out of the deal. But wow, what a flop. Raymond has flopped a pair of fours, but Andres has flopped a straight flush draw. Unbelievable. What drama we're seeing here at this final table. Here comes the turn card. The straight flush draw for Andres. He's got to have help to win this pot and in this tournament right now. Well, seven comes off. That now gives him an open end straight draw as well. So a six would win. A heart would win. An eight would win. A jack would win. So many cards to win it for Andres. Here we go to the river. Who's going to get lucky? Split the money! Oh, man. We've seen some wild celebrations on the World Poker Tour. But this is one of the best. Oh, this is great. you got to love them rooting for their man. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, we got a champion. It is Andres from Hungary. Bring on this guy. So big, I have no idea how much there is. Congratulations to our champion. For Vince Van Patten and everyone at the World Poker Tour, I'm Mike Sexton saying thanks for watching. And until next time, may all your cards be live and your putts be monsters. <laughs> Just like that one. Boy, oh boy. Wow, what a That was incredible. I don't understand what this is for. <laughs>